Hey, my name's Jeff Wilson. I'm here in the Arctic on training for a North Pole expedition coming up on the Arctic Ocean. Just going through one of my most favorite and vital pieces of kit. One of the simplest is this little guy, the Sunto M3 Global Compass. A lot of people are scared of these because they think they're highly technical and need a lot of work to deal with. Don't be, it's as simple as just being a wayfinder, making sure that during your day's travel, especially out here where a lot of it can become very white quickly or there's very little feature, it's just taking a bearing in the morning, the direction you want to travel, and then checking that during the day. You can use a reference point on the map and set a bearing, or you can just get the bearing off your GPS. In reality, unless you're an absolute purist, you're probably getting the bearing off the GPS and then referencing off this. Just be wary when you're in the polar climb, something that I run into all the time is what we call declination, which is the difference between true north and magnetic north. See this little screw on the back, that little grub screw allows you to change for declination. So that's getting a little more technical, probably Google that. Uh, but it's as you get closer to the pole that angle differs so here in the Arctic It's up around 39 40 degrees, which means that true north will be that way magnetic north is 40 degrees off it So that needs to be adjusted for other than that. This is a piece of kit I would not venture into a hostile place whether it be land sea or air without